Good morning, SCS. Welcome to week two of distance learning. So to my eighth graders, um, you've got your week plan up uh, today and um, or yesterday, I should say, and uh, you should be working through that. Hopefully you're doing it day by day and staying on top of your assignments. Uh, today's assignment is all about what are called political cartoons. So political cartoons are usually a one strip comic type thing that is usually poking fun at politics or the government or leaders or issues. Um, yes, they usually make it funny in some way, but they're, they're more importantly, they're trying to send a message. They're trying to convey a message. And so um, a political cartoon a lot of times will have um, like a phrase or a line that goes with it. Um, that's trying to bring attention to an issue or to, um, to uh, corruption or something of that nature. So I've asked for you guys to create a political cartoon about Andrew Jackson's presidency. So choose something that you think was either controversial or um, was a big decision that he made that might have had people upset. Typically, political cartoons um, are not positive. Usually they are... Um, trying to poke fun at um, or drawing attention to some negative feature of some um, of somebody's presidency or policies or so on. So your political cartoon should do just that. Um, you, uh, um, you should make sure that you explain your political cartoon, but also that your political cartoon has a, a phrase or um, like a statement that goes with it that... Um, you know, like, for instance, uh, when my ninth graders did a political cartoon earlier this year, um, they were dealing with the issue of the slaves being freed after the Civil War. Um, however, policies in the government made it so that they were still very much discriminated upon. So, yes, the, the blacks were free after the Civil War, but they were very much still living the same life that they had lived prior to the Civil War. And so one of the political cartoons that they made was, we're free, but we're still in chains, was like the, it was like the, the image that went with it. And so it, it, it showed... Um, black hands with a chain still tied around them. So while, while yes, they were in fact free slaves or free African-Americans, they were no longer, they really weren't technically free based on the um, policies that the government, um, you know, and the discrimination the government showed them. So your uh, political cartoon should deal with Andrew Jackson, um, something with his policies. I would suggest doing something about uh, Andrew Jackson and the National Bank or Andrew Jackson and his policies on Native Americans. Uh, they were both very controversial. And so uh, create an image. You can do this either digitally or on a piece of paper and upload it to Google Classroom. Um, don't forget, we're going to have office hours here today as well as Thursday. If you have any questions about anything, you can feel free to drop in on that and um, make sure that you're staying on top of your work. So have a great day, guys. And as always, go Eagles.